Welcome back to the channel. Today's video is going to be a very short video, no tutorial. I am going to share what I bought for myself for Black Friday. Uh, well, all my friends and family were up and about uh, the entire night shopping uh, for Black Friday. I do not want to go into that frenzy anymore. I had my days, but those are behind me. And now I only go for online shopping once in a while. But I did go for a big uh, shopping for art supplies. I was in need of some things and I went ahead and had a spending spree. So keep watching. Let's start with pastels and paints. You can see that my very new Sennelier oil pastels, this is my first set of Sennelier's. It is a very limited uh, set of colors, only 12 oil pastels, but these are artist grade and I am really, really excited uh, how it would work and uh, so keep uh, an eye out for my upcoming oil pastel tutorials and I'm sure you're going to see some more of that and then I have my Holbein um, watercolor set new one and uh, I have already used some Holbein paints and they are amazing they're highly pigmented the brightness is amazing and although it looks like very teeny tiny tubes they are going to last for a while I promise you are not going to be disappointed with the money that you spend with them other than that I have some new brushes because of course I did not have enough brushes no artist ever has enough brushes and there was a sale and so there are some brushes some watercolor brushes and this would work for all kinds of mediums so I'm not sure where I'm going to use them but I'm going to use them and then I have some makeup brushes no, they're not for makeup. They are for blending. I have found out that makeup brushes work better for acrylic blending uh, instead of a mop brush. They do not shed as much as usual mop brushes do. And finally, some more of paints. I have some Permalba Black oil paint some white and other liquitex basics acrylic paints and some Winsor uh, newton's winton brand of oil paint so yeah i have had a deal and i also have some canvases and these are centurion linen all media primed canvases or other canvas panels and uh, they are um MTF panels uh, suitable for oils and acrylic and mixed media and they are a great bargain so I got them in two different sizes 8 by 10 they come in packs of 3 and 11 by 14 um, because uh, these are the sizes I predominantly work on apart from 16 by 20s so um, and I got a deal too a little bit less than usual although I would love to work on Frederick's canvases all the time that those are uh, Frederick's linen canvases are a tad bit more expensive than they are they're definitely the best but this is also really good they are extremely archival never had any problems with warping or anything and the price point is extremely good considering that these are artist grade and archival as well so give these a try and I have also got myself some 8x10 Protons um, toned canvases. Let me see. Here I also have some 8x10 gray toned Protons uh, all media prime canvases. These are also professional qual quality. They have MDF board inside and uh, they are they have a toned canvas which is something that I like this is a gray toned however they're available in tan and uh, yellows beiges and uh, some other tones as well I think some purples as well so um, they 
are great but they have a little bit more texture than I typically like to have but sometimes I like to have a textured background as well so I thought I'll give a good mix of uh, the Centurion and Protons and again I found a deal so I went ahead and bought them so that's my big Black Friday shopping um, for art supplies my big art haul uh, share with me if you have your own art haul as well for black friday that would be great thank you for watching oh and don't forget to hit the subscribe button and uh, keep watching because i have new videos every t wednesday and friday so thank you for watching